Hi everyone. <laughs> I had to show you what just happened. So I went to pull out some Swarovskis and the container wasn't completely closed and I'm working with my hand off of the uh, splint so I can kind of hold things but not really. <laughs> so needless to say I dropped it and this is what happened. Oh my gosh, look at this. <laughs> now the reason I'm showing you is I don't know if I'm completely upset about this. It's the funniest feeling of having a ton of Swarovski sitting in your lap. <laughs> Feels kind of cool. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's what I get for putting Swarovskis in a container and not baggies. But look at they're everywhere. Just everywhere. And my kitty cat heard me. So he came to rescue and he came and licked my legs. Hey kitty, are you going to help me clean these up? Oh, that's nuts. <laughs> They're everywhere. <laughs> oh, I'm not sure how to get these out of my lap without just dropping them on the floor. Yikes. Anyway, I just thought I'd show you that craziness. Um, let me see if I can just gently turn. Oh, you know what? Let me grab a bowl here and see if I can get these out of my lap. Let's see how this is going to work out. I got some of them. Oh, they're everywhere. <laughs> oh. Anyway, I'm working on a few things, so let me show you. And one of the things I'm working on is the giveaways. So, I don't know, I guess just with everything going on with my hand, I forgot all about the giveaway for last week. So that is, I pulled it out, where is it? Oh, okay, I thought I pulled it out. Oh, here they are. So there's this. Where's the. I'm trying to find the camera here. There. So there's this one here with the cabochon. And um, so I'm going to go ahead and do this. I was getting ready to do it, I figured it would take me a couple of minutes. But then I realized I had missed a bunch of comments and a bunch of people guessed these cabochons. Uh, so I'm definitely going to, and I think maybe even some ginkgos. So what I'd like to do is I'm going to review all of them, the comments, and pull out the ones that people guessed. And those people will get two ballots instead of just the one. So everybody will get a chance, but then the people who guessed will get extra chances. So there's that one, and then there's the one from this week. This bracelet here, this beautiful bracelet with the beautiful Tierra cast button. And um, so yeah, I'm going to do that, but I also wanted to show you what else I'm working on. So I started, I wanted to do, like I bought this um, jewel loom and about a year ago and never used it so I wanted to use it so I started out with this one here with the bead mix from the um, uh, wire wrap bracelet so I just went ahead and threw all of them together and uh, did a bead mix and it turned out really nice and then I watched one of the videos and they used their um, bead tray to do these type of bracelets and they said you know, rather than set up a bunch of different ones and waste a lot of thread, that you could use your warp threads and do a second bracelet. So I decided, my wrists are so small, and actually I made these bigger, I made them for about a 7 inch wrist. So I went ahead and did a second one on it, and I have it all ready to go to cut off and add the leather and the buttons. And 
yeah, so it should be really nice. Um, I was going to do this in a video, but you know what? Putting these wire, uh, the warp threads on was unbelievably hard with my, where's my, with this thumb. It was just ridiculous. So uh, I didn't want to have you guys be, feel sorry for me. So I did it off camera. And again, I think taking it off of those and putting the leather and stuff is going to be frustrating. So I may do that when I'm feeling a little better with my hand. But in the meantime, I wanted to use these gorgeous metal beads that Kath got me. I wanted to use the, um, the crystals that she got me, but... Um, I think that's going to be like bezeling and stuff like that. So I need to be able to use my hand a bit better. But I have these beautiful polymer clay birdies from Joni from uh, Granny J Clay. And take a look. I am going to make a cha-cha bracelet with these guys. So this is what I got started. So this I will show you on camera. But let me move that one out of the way. So these are going to dangle like that. So that should be really cute. So there, so I'm going to do a yellow one and then I'm going to do a purple one because I have a bunch of these purple birdies that she sent me. So yeah, sorry for all the shakiness, but now i got to figure out how to collect all my Swarovskis. Oh my gosh. It was kind of funny at first. Now I feel like crying. It's just nuts. They're everywhere. I'm sure. I'm sure I'll be finding them forever. But you know what? My kitties are good for finding them. They don't eat them. They just stare at them. So that is that so anyway I'm going to review all the the I'm going to review the videos and um, do a uh, a drawing of that for you and I will post that so take care everybody thank you everybody for all the wonderful comments and um, I'm going to get caught up in reading the comments and getting back to you as well there you go bye for now